how you cook deep dish pizza and uni pizza ovens. Beautifully unified Detroit style pizza. Slice and serve hot. Sicily's intriguing history has a rich multicultural past left behind by the different rulers the island has had. Although ubiquitous with Italian cuisine, tomatoes weren't introduced to Sicily until the mid-16th century. So pizza before then was Senza Pomodori. Sicilian-style pizza is known as Sfincione in Italy and was the only type of pizza eaten on the island until the mid-19th century. There are many stories about how Sfincione came to be, including the nuns of the Royal San Vito Monastery in Palermo and their resourceful nature to turn plain bread into something fit for a prince. So, what is Finchone? The Palermitan version is a bracaccia style base topped with a variety of ingredients, including tomato, herbs, onions, cheese, and anchovies, and continues to be a staple of daily life. Each region has its own take on Finchone, both in toppings and form. But today, we're focusing on the original. Here's Slice Monger's take. Add the flour, salt and yeast to the bowl of your stand mixer, followed by the oil and lukewarm water. Mix on low until the flour is absorbed. Then increase the speed and knead until the dough is stretchy and smooth. Cover the dough and proof until doubled in size. Grease the pan with oil and divide the dough by two. Place one half in the pan and press with your fingers until the dough reaches the edges. Top with shredded and torn mozzarella cheese, classic pizza sauce, and grilled aubergine. Cook in your preheated medium hot oven for 12 to 15 minutes, rotating the pan regularly for an even bake. Once cooked, garnish with fresh toned basil, olive oil, and salt and pepper to taste. Serve and enjoy hot. Detroit-style pizza is undoubtedly the most indulgent of all pizza styles. A thick, bouncy base with a crisp bottom crust, absolutely stunningly cheesy edges, and indulgent toppings. Detroit is the ultimate comfort pizza. Detroit was created back in the mid-40s by Buddy's Rendezvous and was based on owner Anna Guerra's mother's recipe for Sicilian pizza. Although there is some controversy, as an employee claimed it was their recipe. The distinctive rectangular shape originates from the metal pans it was originally baked in. Buddies use blue steel pans made from scrap metal created to contain small automotive parts. They were the perfect size and shape for the deep pan pizza style. The distinctive sauce stripes on top are named racing stripes, honoring the Motor City of Detroit. The term Detroit style didn't come into play until the 80s and wasn't widely used until the late 2000s as the style was still referred to as Sicilian. The popularity of Detroit style took off after 2012 when Sean Rendazzo won the Las Vegas International Pizza Expo World Championship with a Detroit style pizza. He went on to train many pizzerias in the style of Detroit. It's a firm favorite at Uni HQ with everyone vying for the corner piece. Check out Christian's how-to guide. Hi, I'm Christian, CEO and founder of Uni. Let's get started. For the ingredients, you'll need 350 grams of strong bread flour, 260 grams of warm water, 3 grams of instant dry yeast, 10 grams of salt, and 20 grams of olive oil, plus extra for the baking trays. Now I'm going to mix the dough on a low to medium setting for about five minutes. So this has risen for about two to three hours. And we're just gonna start gently dimpling it from the top, pushing the dough towards the corners and leave it proof for another 30 minutes. Beat that step until I've got the dough all the way to the corners. Now it's time to fire up your uni pizza oven. Get it up to 840 degrees Fahrenheit or 450 degrees Celsius. So we've got cheese under, make sure that it goes all the way to the edges like that. Next up, plenty of pepperoni. And finally, sauce. Turn the oven all the way down to its minimum power. So the bake time, somewhere between 10 and 15 minutes is gonna be great. Beautifully unified Detroit style pizza. The most famous of the pan pizzas, Chicago style. Yep, you may remember a certain brand of micro pizzas from your youth. Chicago deep dish pizzas are unrivaled in flavor and style with its characteristically tall crust and pastry-like base. Each slice is loaded to the max with cheese, meat, and sauce. Let's skip back to 1943 
Pizzeria Uno in Chicago is commonly cited as the birthplace of Chicago style, but there are conflicts between whether it was founder Ike Sewell or pizza chef Rudy Malnati who first developed the deep dish delight. If that wasn't enough contention, the Savaria Rosati family claimed their recipe for deep dish pizza hasn't changed since Rosati's authentic Chicago pizza opened in 1926. What's food without a little competition and controversy? Slice Munger shows you how in the Uni Skillet Pan. Add the dough ingredients to the bowl of your stand mixer. Attach the dough hook and mix on low until the dough is smooth and slightly sticky. Grease a bowl with melted butter, then turn the dough inside to coat. Cover and rest for two hours at room temperature. Oil your skillet and add half the dough mix to the pan. Push the dough with your fingers out until it reaches the edge. Next. Lightly oil a pan and sweat the onions and peppers over a medium heat, add the sausage and saute until cooked. Top the base with cheese, sausage mix and classic pizza sauce. Cook at the back of the medium-low oven for 5 minutes, then move to the front for 20 minutes, turning regularly. That's how you cook deep dish pizza in uni pizza ovens. Slice and serve hot.